I always knew that I'm gonna do something on my own and it's gonna be something that makes me feel human and makes me feel like so excited every single day that I'm going to do this and it all started when I was young when I was 11 all right guys Friday night hustle we're here with Sean at Yo. athlete headquarters this place is huge they are right over there we've been shooting for like two hours talking about where we want to go with the brand dead yeah. oh, right. it was good seeing you cool. the Friday hustle Derek, we've been hitting. Huh? What happened? Who hurt you? I got an infection. <laughs> no, no way! Yeah. That's the least cool thing. Who are you gonna go work out with today? One of my subscribers. Not you. Yeah, I have better shit to do. Yeah. So guys, I didn't do any more recording last night. Just went out with some friends. Now, I'm head to the gym because we're hitting a workout with a subscriber called Adam. We've been putting it off for a while. Uh, we were meant to hit it like two weeks ago. So we're doing it now. Picked up Derek's card because uh, like a uh, entry to my gym is like 12 pound 50 if you're like under 17 and then like 25 pounds if you're over 17. So I just thought I'd pick up his card and give it to the guy. Uh, how are you, bro? See you. <laughs> 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 oh, really? All right guys, so I'm really sorry. I completely forgot to put in like a spare battery. So I have like no charge to do an edit. So we'll have to do like a raw workout. Powered by Athlete today. I got my own chest and back compound. So we'll be running through that with Adam. So as I said, I'll leave you guys with some raw clips. Maybe put a voiceover, we'll see. So we'll cue that in three, two. Easy? Kinda. All done with the workout. Next yep. stop, Whole Foods. Damn, eat your greens. <laughs> so Adam and I were just talking about like how expensive food can get. We're here at Whole Foods, um, but we were also talking about like your earning potential, and you may spend like double on your food, triple on your food, but your earning potential is like triple, quadrupled. It's an investment you gotta make. All right, see you, man. See you, bro. Call it a very stupid or glaring mistake. Or a fruit eating monkey with a prehensile tail and a loud <laughs> howling call. Native for the forest of tropical America. Why are you taking my towel? Why are you taking his toes? No, just leave it on the floor. I'm gonna throw it out now because he touched it. <laughs> Alright, guys, so we're at Filippo's house right now, which is why like, I don't have the boxing and everything. It's two days on from when I last picked up the camera. I got a new little toy. So I picked up the Sony RX100 Mark IV. You can see Filippo hey. <laughs> over the camera. Um, yeah, I mean, 
it's really, really hard to carry this like fucking big, like the Sony A7. Um, it's hard to carry around that around with like the lens and the mic and everything. And I really just wanted like to not have any more excuses not to vlog. So I decided to pick this up. Um, pretty big investment, but I think it should be worth it. I've looked at like some of the quality on it. Uh, amazing 4K, so I might start filming 4K then bring that down in the timeline to like 1080, 24 frames per second. If anyone has an experience with that, let me know below. That would be pretty cool, but uh, yeah, some exciting content with this. All right, guys, so you are looking at the Sony RX100 Mark IV now. Still haven't really had time to play around with it. I actually, in, in a couple of my school free periods, I just went to like a local camera store and picked this camera up, which brings me to my point and what I want to leave you guys with. I was talking to a couple of my mentors and they were affirming what I had already thought and that's that I should put more time and effort into my own personal brand. Now this past couple months have been crazy. Everything that I envisioned has just kind of manifested and that's super cool and weird to see at the same time. And I've gone to a place financially where things are going really, really well. Like, I mean, this camera is 800 pounds and I just went and picked it up because I thought it was the right move and I never would have been able to do that six months ago or a year ago. Things have literally blown up for me. Things have literally blown up for me and all the hard work that I put in, I'm now reaping the rewards. That said, this is like the first time I'm picking up the camera properly in like two weeks and that's because I'm getting all this new client work and I'm, I'm doing all this marketing and branding and starting to get more clients long term. And what really worries me about that is that I'll forget my own personal brand and where I wanna, like my, my North Star. Because at the end of the day, like I don't wanna just be selling time for money and my personal brand is probably like the one thing that I really just wanna leverage. And I wanna tell my story because I know it's a very unique one. Not many people are like me at this age, but I know a lot of people have the aspiration to do something like me at this age and they just need someone to show them how it's done because uh, to be honest, I don't know any other 17 year old who's like so into entrepreneurship, is out there making his own money at this age, networking with really influential people, getting paid to travel for what he loves to do. So that's something I really wanna share with you guys. And that's like, for example, one of the reasons I bought this vlogging camera, as well as um, I'm gonna start investing a lot more money uh, into like promotions and stuff like that, advertising, and really turn into myself and figure out what my brand story is and what really sets me apart and what I have to offer with the world. So I really hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, leave a like, it means the world to me. I'm serious guys, I'm about to step everything up. 2017 already has been the craziest year of my life <laughs> and there are big things coming, I'm telling you. So leave a like if you enjoyed. Cue the outro in three, two, yeah. You feel the pressure, man, I know the pressure. And my wifey is a spice like I'm David Beckham. A lot of pent-up aggression coming.